my Pokeballs, and we're howling back at you with some more Pokemon Emerald Randomizer Nuzlocke. We're gonna make some more progress in the story today, hopefully get some more encounters knocked out without them and knocking us out, and hopefully we can make some progress and get up to the point where we're almost fighting Roxanne. We may not get to Roxanne in this episode because it's gonna be a long road in that because we still got a bunch of encounters before that, and then we have uh, some story dialogue before that, so we may save Roxanne for the next episode, so that'll be a lot of fun. Well, yeah, I'm coming with you, buddy. Alright, Wally, what are you gonna catch? What are you gonna catch this time? What are we catching? He's getting artillery. Oh, yeah. That's fun. He's got a grown pig. That's funny, this thing's gonna turn into a grown pig. Grown pig got drunk. Everything's gonna have weather in this game again, isn't it? That's how it's gonna be. Got it. Rough skin. Ooh. Ooh, that's fun. That's indeed fun. Oh, yeah. We're just waiting until he gets done defeating this guy and that, but... I do hope you are enjoying the series so far. I'm having a lot of fun with this because, yeah, I really love Emerald. Emerald used to be my go-to game when I when I was a kid. I'd play it a lot, countless time, and playing it as a randomizer again has been uh, pretty hype, pretty hype. Especially since stuff like this happens where you run into a Jirachi and a Lugia for your first two encounters, you can't do anything. And Ampharos is not bad, so... It's really cool that we got an Ampharos. So I'm looking forward to seeing what we get next. Hopefully it's something I can catch and hopefully it's something good. But uh, we'll see. We shall see. It's funny that I'm more excited to play a randomizer than I am a new Pokemon game right now. Which is weird, but at the same time, I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. It's a weird it's a weird conundrum in that. Like, at the same time, I'm enjoying the new Pokemon games, but at the same time, I'm not as excited to play them. Like, I had more excitement when my when uh, Chaos and Kong and them were here, because I'm like, oh yeah, I can play the games with my friends now, and they're here, and I get to hang out with them, and then as soon as they left, it's like, I'm playing Scarlet right now. I don't know why. It's just, like, all the motivation to play, it's like, yeah, I don't feel like playing it right this minute. We're fine. Okay. We get an encounter over here. Hey, Scott. You're a Pokemon trainer. You're the rookie of maybe an old man, kid. Um, I'm literally just got my Pokemon, okay? I ran into a Jirachi and a Lugia. Leave me alone. Alright, we're at 104 encounter B. A Caterpie. Alright, I guess we're getting a Caterpie again. So we may end up getting a good Butterfree, which is awesome. It's T Wave. Limber. You know what? You know what? You butt. Uh. You can't paralyze it because it is limber. That's also what my previous one had in my previous run of Emerald, so. You need to stop re randomizing to the same ability guy. Got it, got it, got it, ew. Uh, but we'll see what the Butterfree is, so... I don't know, we'll have a Caterpie. Come on, stand the ball. Yeah. It doesn't want to stand the ball, man. It doesn't want to stand the ball, man. We're gonna catch it, we're gonna chuck it, and we're gonna throw it. We're running out of Pokeballs for these things. I don't have a way to hurt this without killing it, I don't think. I, don't, I think a tackle would kill it. I think a tackle would kill it. Yes, we're gonna try. YOLO. Don't kill it. Don't crit it, Ampy, please. I wanna keep encounters. There we go. Okay, I guess we're good. We're good on that. Fine. Everything's fine. Don't worry about it. Don't cry. Don't die. Can't stay in the ball. Okay, there we go. We got ourselves a little Caterpie to add to the layout, which will probably be, by the end of this episode, probably a Butterfree at that point, so... 
Ain't gonna lie, ain't gonna lie. Ain't gonna lie, ain't gonna die. Oh, uh, no. Butterfree backwards. Yeah! Let's go heal our team up. Grab some more Pokeballs. Get our next encounter. Hopefully. There's a good question of the day for you guys. Question of the day! What's the Pokemon you always have a nickname for? You can, um, they, whenever you catch that Pokemon, you always have a nickname for it, no matter what it. When you catch it, where you catch it. What game you catch it in? It's always gonna be the same nickname every time. What do you guys nickname for it? I could have had a Kingler? Come on. Uh. Fine. We need to get our Caterpie up front so we can start switch training it, at least. It's got Limber, so. We need to get it to a Buddha Free. A Buddha Free. A beautiful, beautiful Buddha Free. Boom. And boom. Get ourselves some pitch berries. Got ourselves some uh, one berries. Let's see what we could have got else here. We could have. Why is my routes full of freaking legendaries? Uh, I want that though so bad, but there would have been no way I would have caught that if it would have been my encounter. Oh, Sag. This game has taught me like the previous game Alpha Sapphire did, and knows I want Rayquaza. And it's like, here you go, you can't catch it, but here you go. This is also gonna be massive experience for the team. So that's why I'm killing it. Especially for her pretend. I'm trying to get around the trainer, okay? The Firo. I could have had a Firo. Like I said, I'm switch training. We get an encounter in the forest, so that's cool. That should kill, actually. E. We get our encounter in the forest. Yeah, up we go. Alright. Encounter time! That was quick. What are we getting? Why, game? Why? I can't catch that thing! Uh, we're all there. Stop giving me legendaries! I don't want them! Out right now, at least. I can't catch them. Let me tell you, I tell you game. I can't catch the legendaries. Uh. Congrats. It's also in generation where you can still paralyze under type, so. Yeah. Let's see it. We'll chuck a couple balls at it. See where we get. See where we get. I'm not wasting too many balls on it because I'm gonna need them for later encounters, but we'll chuck a couple balls at it, try to humor it. We'll try to humor it. It's not gonna get anywhere though, so. Yeah. Yep. That's what I thought. I'm not gonna chuck any more balls at it. I need to save my Pokeballs. We're gonna kill it off and say that our counter was dead, so we lost three encounters already because they were freaking legendaries. Let's go back and heal up our team. As I run into a wild Pokemon again. I do iterate, the shiny claws is an effect for this game series. Uh, cause odds are full odds for this game. So if I do come across a shiny, it will be a full odds shiny, and I will be able to use it. So if I run into a full odds shiny Rayquaza, early game, I'm gonna cry. 
But if I run into a full on Strakariza shiny and I can ever catch it, I will catch it. If I can catch it. Alright, perfect. We're getting ourselves a Metapod. Metapod! But yeah, I always have nicknames for certain Pokemon, like, um, let's see, uh, Butterfree usually is a I have a couple nicknames for some of my other team members, like, um, I usually name my, um, what was it, um, uh, Blastoise Shellshocker from the anime Pokemon movie, the first movie, so, there's that. Check out Earth for as a new ability. Shadow Tag. It's a sassy bug. Got Shadow Tag. Okay. Okay, man. Calm yourself. Calm yourself, man. Right, let's go back here, grab some more Pokeballs since we need to buy some more Pokeballs. I know we can't buy too many of them because we spent it all on potions and Pokeballs previously. We do have a three team member squad. That's something to keep note of. Also, I need to remember to timestamp things, otherwise a future will post is gonna be yelling at me. Cause, yeah, she's gonna have to go through the video and be like, Hey, what are you doing? I can buy a Pokeball. Yeah, this is why we don't waste Pokeballs in Emerald, because you don't get money as abundantly as you do in Alpha Sapphire. It's a huge difference in that aspect in that, so... I need to stop running into wild Pokemon. Is that too? Manu. We do have a Metapod, so. Ah, oh, let me leave. Trying to kill my Metapod. Will you let me? I'm not risking it. I'm not risking it. I know I could try to escape, but I'm not risking it just in case he hit his attack. He's showing my defense too much, and I do like it. Run. Run. Do, 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 do. Run. But yeah, I'm gonna have some fun trying this series out for a bit. Dang it! Poopa Trainer. You've been fated, man. Play a battle. How about no? How about no? Let's do a god skip loom. Hi, skip loom. How are you? How are you today? You need to get powerful some more action. I don't know why my team's leveled up so quickly. It normally doesn't level up this quickly. Got color change, okay. Alright, okay, I see you out here. You with the color change and skip loops. Fine. Fine. We don't have to worry about anything. Why do you have a full restore this early on, bro? This is what I mean by the game's gonna be a little bit harder. Pe trainers will have AIs like that. To be able to use that. They have abilities, they have moves, they all have items. And it's dead. But yeah, I made it a little bit more difficult with the aspect of adding the more trainer Pokemon because I'm already used to it. The Lair on. I don't have a good way to deal with Lair on. That thing knocks out my Ampharos and my Humidipod, so my Puffles is. Uh, Definitely a play for that thing. Because later on, I can't handle that. I need to get my XP in here as well, so that would be helpful. Let's use. I'm not running back to the Pokemon Center, so let's use a potion. And let's go back into the forest and start the story log of that. Dang it! I ran into a freaking trainer again! But let's see if we can get a Butterfree by the end of the episode. Hey, Sharpedo, how are you? Because our uh, Butterfree would really be beneficial more over everything else, so. Amphi's getting a lot of experience because Amphi's my good way to deal with all these early Monmar encounters because, as you can see, they've been a bunch of water and flying types, so. Why not use Ampharos? It's also, uh, Puffles is a good way to deal with other things if we were trying to keep alive. And then Arthurtub just doesn't handle anything right now. Fion, 
Also, why do you have five Pokemon? You got air on. Okay. You are a steel rock? Yeah. I didn't know if you were still ground or still rock. But you're dead. Dugong. You definitely can't send out an um, Earth to. I want to get experience for him, but. I'm worried about that. You crit it. You didn't need to crit it, man. You didn't need to crit it. Bell toy. Alright, we're gonna switch out. We're gonna do switch training. We're gonna switch out so we can get some experience from these Pokemon. And we're gonna send him Puffles to deal with the Bell toy. Wait a minute. I can't send Puffles in to deal with the Bell toy. I know why? I can't hit it with normal moves. This is why we need Amphi. But at the same time, I can't hit it with Amphi either. Because it is a ghost ground type. Okay, I can hit it with Amphi. Okay, it's not ghost ground yet. It's just ground right now. Okay. I was a bit worried there. I'm like, um, game? You know I can't hit the ghost, right? I was misremembering there. That's my bad. Why? I think we just lose here. We got one regard Sunrock. I have no way to deal with this thing. I can't deal with this thing. I gotta stall him out. Like, bruh. I can't poison anything. I can't... Fuse him. I gotta stall him out of moves. Oh, we're gonna get this going. I gotta stall him out of tackles. Like, sheesh. I get him to struggle range. So you have thirty five tackles, so. A good play to do it, but I can't hit a Wonder Guard Pokemon. I can't. There's no way I can. Gotta be careful too because I'm trying to keep count of his tackles because he's paralyzed. He's not been able to use them. Send an Amphi. And then we gotta wait till it struggles to death, so I still think I lose this. Out of tackles now. Now we gotta stall him out of the rest of his moves. There we go. Ugh. I need a way to heal. I don't have a way to heal. I have worm berries. Now we gotta make him struggle to death. That was a fight and a half. Wonder Guard Soy Rock when I have no way to hit it. Sheesh. yourself off. There we go. Sheesh! 
no, just no. There's no good way to deal with Wonder Guard like that. Like, sheesh. Now we're gonna run back and heal. Like, bruh. What was I supposed to do there? I'm sorry if I did that, like, that made it upsetting for anybody, but what else was I supposed to do there? He had Wonder Guard and I had no way to hit him. I had to stall him out. Like, I ran out of potions because of him. I ran out of Ornberries almost because of him, like, bruh. No, I don't want to go back into the PC. Everything's fine. We made it past the Wonder Garden Soy Rocket Beast. This game is out to get me already. I can see it already. Urgh! It didn't give me any way. I mean, it did, but it didn't. So I wasn't able to catch the mons that gave me to deal with it. Will you let me leave, cat? Come on. Let me leave, cat. You're supposed to be afraid of me, Skylar, Kappa. Thank you. Kill my eye, Metapod. You're gonna die. Like, sheesh, I have no good way to heal anymore. I have to be like, relying on potions and stuff now. Like, Dive ball. Eh, another Pokeball sounds good. Alright, buddy. Buddy old pal of mine. You're looking for Shroomish. I haven't seen a Shroomish, I'm sorry, buddy. End up with them papers. No! No, come on, bail me. Okay, Team Aqua. Oh, this is brutal off from the get-go, man. We got two Pokemon. Please don't have Wonder Guard. Please don't have Wonder Guard. Urban Tube's probably dead here. Don't hurt yourself. Please, don't hurt yourself. Yup. <laughs> Why? This is probably where the run ends, to be honest. Alright, I'm not T-waving her this time. Yeah, we're gonna- we're gonna try to keep Vampy alive. I have no way to heal, though. So this is probably the run right here and then. Uh, we'll be on attempt two in the next one, apparently, because Wonder Guard Soy Rocks are a bean! But we'll see where it takes us. I have no way to heal. Like I said, I have uh, no way to heal here. Alright. Like, what am I supposed to do against the Wonder Guard Pokemon that I can't touch? Or even, uh, purple. I don't know. Honestly, I uh, do not know where I'm supposed to go anymore, so. Yeah. That's fun. It's fine. It's just fine, man. Oh, uh, I got puffles left, so. Accept your fate and die. Oh, brother. Guys, there is the run for today. We'll start attempt number two in the next one. Hopefully we don't run into Wonder Guard Soy Rocks we can't touch because that was the whole reason we lost this run is because we couldn't touch the Wonder Guard Soy Rocks, so that's always a fun shenanigans and such, but feel free to answer that question today in the comments section down below. Let me know your thoughts and what you like to think on the such those patterns of things to see. I'm hoping that hopefully we don't run into any Wonder Guard uh, Soy Rocks anymore because that one sucked. That one really sucked. I had no way to deal with the Slay Rocks. I really didn't. But, question of the day for you, 
two for you guys. Would you have done these fights any differently with the Slayer Rocks and that? What would you have done in my situation? And would you have counted those as deaths or such? I count those as deaths because they actually died. There was no way I could deal with it, but it still counts because it was part of the Nuzlocke. But feel free to answer that in the questions, the, both the questions of the day in the comment section down below. And hopefully I'll see you guys in the next one with a longer bit of a run because we didn't even make it to Roxanne this time. It's just sad. Emerald's not, not liking me. Emerald does not like me, and I don't know why Emerald does not like me. I like it, but it does not like me. It's like Kit, Jimmy's cat Skyler. He don't, doesn't like me for some reason. He's scared of me. I don't know. But... Oh, Emerald is Skyler? Got it. Got it. But I do appreciate you guys watching. I hope you've enjoyed the series so far. We'll be back next time with the new starters and such. And I will see you guys in the next one. So feel free to leave a like, subscribe for more content from me, and make sure you check out all the links in the description down below. But for now, this is your girl, Cyclonic Wolfos, signing off. Stay safe, keep howling, and stay furious, my friends.